Fever Spotlight Game, brought to you by Lola's Handcrafted Kitchen. The Fever Spotlight Game takes us to Love Lady, where the Lions come into this matchup with Sabine Pass undefeated, looking to keep on rolling toward this championship. Ashlyn Anderson joins us live from Lions Stadium in Love Lady to show us how they fared against those visiting Sharks. Ashlyn, take it away. Here in Lions Stadium in Love Lady, it was a blowout, I tell you, from the undefeated Love Lady Lions against the Sabine Pass Sharks. But I'd rather just show you than tell you. Let's get to the highlights. The Sabine Pass Sharks come out onto the field, and here are your Love Lady Lions charging onto the field right behind them. Quarterback Sean Easterling throws to number 12, Skylar Pippen, for the first touchdown of the night with a successful two point conversion to follow. Easterling takes the snap, hands off to Cortavius Whitaker, who breaks the tackle and just walks right into the end zone with no sweat. Easterling takes the snap and hands off to Davian Skinner, who almost gets tackled but charges forward, sees nothing but green grass, touchdown, love lady. Easterling again, hands off to Jordan Blackmon, who sees Ryland Johnson and skirts to the left and passes him in a little trip into the end zone, another touchdown for the Lions. Second quarter, Easterling finds Jaden Crawford with the incomplete lateral pass. It dribbles off the ground back into his hands, and it's a foot race down the sideline. Stays in bounds for another touchdown. Lions have the ball again. Easterling fakes the entire Shark defense, including myself. Quarterback keeper Easterling has the ball running down the field with no one in sight. Hops over the defense into the end zone and is fired up. Let's take a look at that scoreboard. 62 to nothing. The Lions took it all. Coach Kirov says he's proud of his guys and they're getting better and better each week. These guys continue just to get better and better every week. We talk a lot about just making sure that we're sharpening our own sword and making sure we're improving ourselves. So when we get up ready for this playoff run and to play for the district title here over the next two weeks that um, we're at our best and we continue to move forward and get better each week. The Love Lady Lions did exactly what they set out to do on offense and also on defense with stopping those Sharks and not just stopping them, but pushing them back every chance they get. I'm reporting in Love Lady, Ashlyn Anderson. Garrett, I'll send it back to you.